What is going on guys? Up in Adam early on a Friday morning. Walking to the metro station right now. Heading into DC. Not sure exactly where we're gonna go from there. But just, well, I'm sure we'll find something to do. Good morning Kev. How you doing Kev? Doing good man. What's going on? Kev is my tour tour guide? Maybe? It's kind of my tour guide. My host. For the weekend if he gets his papers written we're heading to the metro now successfully got a metro car ready to roll kevin might soon be fired we almost didn't get on the right train thank you to the attendant who told us which train we we're about to miss We got off to Chinatown just because, and it's just instant museums. Now the decision is, where do we start? International Spy Museum? Maybe. Nothing can come between us. You and me, we're staying alive. Alive, forever alive. So hear me out. Telling you now, we're gonna go all the way up. Ixnay on the Spy Museum. Didn't feel like paying, so we're just gonna keep it moving. I'm in love with this city already. Just the, the architecture and just, it's just beautiful. It's amazing. We've got an amazing day. It is so beautiful out. Not a cloud in the sky. Lots, lots of students out here. It's like field trip central. But it's amazing just walking around. It's so nice out here. And the architecture is amazing. That's what I can't get over. It's like the buildings and everything. It's crazy. All right, Kev's right. You and me won't take notice of any smooth talk or bad vibes coming up, and you know it. You and me, we're staying alive. Think the crazy guys at home? Probably is causing trouble for the rest of us. So hear me out. Telling you now, we're gonna go all the way up. Cause we got it all figured it out. For the both of us, we've been rolling now. Right there is the goal for today to get inside that building. It may prove difficult because it's sold out for like years to come. That is the new African American History Museum. And hopefully we're getting in there today. Hey boys, stay on this side. Stay Heading right now side. to touch the monument. Because apparently Kevin says that's a thing that people do. One in Rome. My thoughts exactly. Oh, that was exhilarating. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell like how high that is. Like looking up is crazy. Like that's essentially my point of view. But if you move out a little bit, that's amazing. Right, so we're headed towards Lincoln now. We arrive at the World War II Memorial. Right on cue. I would like to go there at the back of the house where a high school teacher. Grabbed a seat real quick. Looks like we have some sort of middle school band or something that's about to perform. So we're gonna check them out. We've got no real schedule, so it's nice. We can kind of just roam around and do whatever. up to see honestly the view looking back is amazing. Like, 
Look at that. That's incredible. Incredible. All right, cue normal tourist selfie with Abe. Coming up in your noise. You and me, we're staying alive, alive forever. Alive. Time for a quick lunch. Found some food trucks. So I'm getting a what is it? A veggie souvlaki sandwich uh, from this Greek place, just with no cheese and uh, no tzatziki sauce. That they use sour cream, so I asked for it without that. So looking, looking good for a first vegan meal here in DC. Alright, we're now in line hoping to get just like walk-up tickets to get into the African American History Museum. It's not a really long line, but it's kind of a long line. So we're hoping we get in. Alright, we're moving. We can see the guy handing out tickets. It's a little bit nerve-wracking. I think it might be close. We're almost there. You got it. You got it. Always yeah, you did. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Apparently, we have uh, airport security to get into the African American History Museum. This should be fun. <laughs> <laughs> so it is now the next day saturday morning um, i made the decision not to film inside the inside the museum uh, which i'm gonna get into the last thing that you guys saw was us right just getting right inside and then we were going up the elevator um, but as we started to go around i just i really wanted to take it in uh, especially me being an african-american and having that history kind of in my in my lineage my ancestors uh, you could say so as I was as I was walking around and, and just reading there's so much to see and to read and um, a lot of it was just really hitting hitting home for me so it was it was it was a really powerful experience and I just kind of wanted to take it in without having to think about um, like good shots for the vlog and and all that type of thing. So I hope you guys understand uh, where I was coming from in that aspect. I definitely, definitely recommend uh, no matter what your race is to definitely check out this museum. It was fantastic. So many things to read, just so much history just staring you in the face everywhere you turn. It was a great experience, especially for me. Um, a lot of things really hit home for me, and I, it was just a—it was just a great experience. So I'm sorry that uh, none of that none of that footage made it into the blog. I did put up a little bit on Snapchat, um, just some cool pictures and and stuff. But as far as recording for the vlog, I just decided to take it all in. So I apologize. I hope you guys understand where I'm coming from. I'm sure many of you would make the same decision. Uh, as I did. So that's gonna do it for me. That was Friday, it was an awesome day, first day in DC. We are getting ready to head out now, back into downtown, just have a few more museums on tap for today. Hoping to have a great Saturday. Uh, whenever you guys are watching this, I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I will see you in the next video. Must be the deli. Peace out.